Now, meteorologist Jamie Jarosik and your Storm Team 2 forecast. Checking out your forecast, heading out for a walk today. Definitely be bundled up because it's going to be cold, colder even than yesterday. This morning, temperatures are still expected to drop into the teens, and it's going to feel like the single digits going into the afternoon. We'll see a little sunshine, which will be nice after a few morning flurries. Lunchtime temperature 24 at 4 o'clock will be right around 28 degrees, so running below normal on those temperatures. But again, getting into the afternoon, less of a chance of any flurries. We'll just be dealing with a pretty decent wind chill this morning. Occasionally it's been dipping into the single digits, so that'll be a potential right on through 9 10 o'clock. And then in the afternoon, it's going to come back up into the teens. It'll feel more like 18 degrees between 4 and 6, even as we hit eyes in the upper 20s. It's going to feel about 10 degrees colder. The breeze will be coming in between 10 and 15 miles per hour. So yeah, we'll be dealing with a decent breeze there. On live Doppler 2 HD radar, you can see some occasional returns moving through. Those are flurries. We have a northwest flow coming off of Lake Michigan, so that will continue for the morning hours. You can see more back to the northwest. Those will continue to drop in. We are not expecting any of this to accumulate, but a few snowflakes early on are definitely possible. Future track starting us off with some of those bands of clouds as we head through the lunch hour. We'll see less of that and it does look mostly sunny to partly sunny for the drive home at five o'clock tonight. Also partly cloudy and pretty quiet into tomorrow morning. We have more sunshine in the forecast for Friday, so it's going to be a nice bright finish to the week. Mostly sunny Friday at noon and even later in the afternoon hours. We're still looking pretty clear. Enjoy the sun because things are going to be changing over the weekend. We're tracking the next storm. Saturday will feature increasing clouds through the afternoon. This is 3 p.m. Saturday. Most of the daylight hours Saturday look to be dry, but by evening we're going to see some precipitation move in. So this is initially going to start off maybe briefly as a rain snow mix. Saturday night it looks like it's going to change over to all snow. Parts of the Miami Valley are going to see some snow accumulate. Road conditions will deteriorate Saturday night into Sunday morning. And then you can see Sunday at 7 a.m. we start to see some rain pushing into the southern counties. That rain snow line will then go north. So we're going to get that messy changeover. And even though road conditions will improve in terms of snow cover, it's going to be slushy and wet. So uh, definitely not a great travel day Sunday. Uh, stay tuned as we continue to track that storm. We'll keep you posted on how much snow we're going to see and who will see the most. Today we're up to 28, partly sunny, a breezy cold afternoon. Tonight, very cold, dropping to 15 degrees. Tomorrow we'll be right back up near 30. Lots of sunshine on Friday and then increasing cloud Saturday with a chance of some rain or snow showers in the evening, changing to snow Saturday night. And then rain will change back over to rain Sunday with a high of 40 degrees. Then Monday, we still will have some lingering snow showers as colder air moves in. Highs will be in the 30s through midweek.